In a rapidly advancing technological world, the notion of creating a robot army may seem like science fiction. However, with Raspberry Pi, a credit card-sized single board computer, and ingenuity, this dream becomes tangible. Picture a fleet of intelligent robots, each with specific tasks, under the control of your Raspberry Pi-powered central command center. Want to turn this into a reality? Well, this video delves into making your own robot army, programming the Pi, and showcasing real-world examples of successful Raspberry Pi-powered marvels. But first, what is Raspberry Pi? The Raspberry Pi is a series of small single-board computers developed in the United Kingdoms by the Raspberry Pi Foundation. Its inception in 2012 aimed to promote the teaching of basic computer science in schools and developing countries. However, its potential quickly outgrew its educational purpose, and it has since found a wide range of applications, from media streaming to weather monitoring and, of course, robotics. Raspberry Pi offers a powerful processor, GPIO, General Purpose Input-Output, pins for hardware interfacing, and the ability to run various operating systems, making it an ideal choice for robotics projects. But there are several other benefits to using Raspberry Pi in robotics as well. First, it's affordable, making it accessible to hobbyists and students. Second, it's versatile, capable of running various operating systems and programming languages. Third, it's compact and lightweight, making it ideal for use in mobile robots. Finally, it has a large and active community, which means plenty of resources, tutorials, and support are available. Having said that, before diving into Raspberry Pi robotics, it's also essential to understand the key components of a robot. A robot is an autonomous or semi-autonomous machine that can perform tasks in the physical world. It typically consists of the following parts. Chassis the physical body of the robot that provides the structure and support for other components. The choice of chassis depends on the type of robot you want to build, whether it's a wheeled robot, a robotic arm, or a drone. Motors Actuators that provide movement to the robot. Different types of motors can be used, such as DC motors for wheeled robots, servo motors for robotic arms, and brushless motors for drones. Sensors Sensors are the robot's senses, allowing it to perceive its environment and gather data for decision-making. Common sensors include ultrasonic distance sensors for obstacle avoidance, cameras for visual perception, and infrared sensors for line following. Motor Controllers These devices interface between the Raspberry Pi and motors, transforming the commands from the Pi into motor movement. Motor controllers ensure precise control over the robot's motion and speed. Now that we have a basic understanding of the components, let's explore how to program Raspberry Pi for robotics. Python is a popular programming language for Raspberry Pi due to its simplicity, readability, and vast community support. To get started, just install Python for Raspberry Pi usually comes with it pre-installed. However, it's essential to check and install the latest versions using package managers like apt or pip. Once done with that, you can use popular Python integrated development environments, IDEs, like Thani or Visual Studio Code to write and debug your code. However, to interact with the physical world, we need to control motors and read data from sensors using Raspberry Pi. The RPI.GPIO library provides access to the GPIO pins, allowing you to control motors, while libraries like Pi Camera enable you to capture images from a connected camera module. With the groundwork laid, let's explore various types of robots that can be built using Raspberry Pi. 1. Wheeled Robots Wheeled robots are an excellent starting point for beginners in robotics. To build a simple wheeled robot, follow these steps. Select the chassis. Choose a suitable robot chassis with mounting points for motors and the Raspberry Pi. The chassis should be sturdy enough to support the weight of the components. Attaching motor. Connect DC motors to the chassis and secure them in place. The number of motors depends on the desired movement capabilities of the robot. For example, a two-wheeled robot with a differential drive requires two motors. Motor control. Use motor controllers to drive the motors and wire Python code to control the robot's movement. 
By controlling the speed and direction of the motors, you can make the robot move forward, backwards, turn left, turn right, and perform other maneuvers. Adding Sensors Enhance the robot's capabilities by adding sensors, like ultrasonic distance sensors or obstacle avoidance. With the data from the sensors, the robot can detect obstacles in its path and adjust its movement to avoid collisions. 2. Robotic Arms Building a robotic arm is a more complex endeavor that involves multiple degrees of freedom. Follow these steps to create a simple robotic arm. Mechanical Design Design the structure of the robotic arm. Consider the number of joints and degrees of freedom. The number of joints determines the range of motion of the arm, while the degrees of freedom define the number of independent movements the arm can make. Servo Motors Choose servo motors for each joint to provide precise control. Servo motors are ideal for robotic arms as they can be controlled with high accuracy, allowing the arm to reach specific positions and angles. Motor Control Connect the servo motor to the Raspberry Pi and program the movements of the robotic arm. By sending appropriate signals to the servo motors, you can control the angle of each joint and create complex movements. End Effector Add a gripper or tool at the end of the arm to interact with objects. The gripper can be a simple claw-like mechanism or a specialized tool depending on the application of the robotic arm. 3. Quadcopters and Drones or quadropters are flying robots with four motors. Building a quadcopter with Raspberry Pi involves the following steps. Choose the frame. Select a quadcopter frame that is compatible with the Raspberry Pi and motor controls. The frame should be lightweight and rigid to ensure stable flight. Propellers and motors. Choose appropriate propellers and motors for the quadcopter. The choice of propellers affects the thrust and stability of the quadcopter, while the motor should provide enough power to lift the entire weight of the quadcopter. Flight Control Set up the Raspberry Pi as the flight control and use sensor data for flight stabilization. The flight controller processes data from various sensors, such as the gyroscope and accelerator, to maintain the quadcopter's stability during flight. Remote Control Implement remote control capabilities using Wi-Fi or radio transmitters. With remote control, you can pilot the quadcopter and perform various aerial maneuvers. To gain inspiration and insight into the endless possibilities of Raspberry Pi-powered robots, let's examine a home automation robot that can control smart home devices through voice commands, making it a versatile and interactive addition to the smart home setup. The robot can be equipped with voice recognition capabilities to understand spoken commands from the user. Using natural language processing, the robot can interpret commands and control various smart devices, such as lights, thermostats, and entertainment systems. For example, the user can simply say, Robot, turn off the lights, and the robot will execute the command, creating a seamless and hands-free home automation experience. Congratulations, you have now journeyed through the exciting world of building your own robot army with Raspberry Pi. From understanding the basics of Raspberry Pi and robotics to exploring various types of robots and real-world examples, you are equipped with the knowledge to embark on your robotics adventure. Whether you want to build a fleet of autonomous drones, a team of intelligent home automation robots, or a specialized robot for a specific task, the possibilities are limited only by your imagination. So, go ahead, unleash your creativity, and build the robot army of the future with Raspberry Pi at its heart. Got questions you'd like to address? Leave them in the comments below. This brings us to the end of this video. If you liked it, please consider subscribing and sharing so we can keep bringing more content like this. See you next time.